It's been nothing but twists and turns in the Rust shooting case against actor Alec Baldwin. The case is now set to go before a grand jury after New Mexico prosecutors say additional facts have come to light in connection with Baldwin's fatal shooting of Helena Hutchins. It should have been a cold gun with no rounds inside. Prosecutor Kerry Morrissey told the New York Times the forensic testing of the gun concluded with certainty that the trigger of the gun had to have been pulled for the gun to go off. But just six months ago, prosecutors dismissed involuntary manslaughter charges against the actor, saying they had evidence the gun may have been modified before the shooting and malfunctioned. His lawyers say they will answer any charges in court. CBS News legal analyst Ricky Kleeman says the new gun analysis may not help the prosecution since it relied on replacement parts to reassemble the pistol fired by Baldwin. What you have is a built-in defense that this new report is based on faulty information because it has the wrong parts. But Kleeman says prosecutors need to have a clear argument. The prosecution cannot be muddy here. Was it because Alec Baldwin was the shooter? Or was it because Alec Baldwin was the producer? And there was all kinds of negligence on the set.